this channel welcome for those of you who are new here welcome 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 for all my subbies welcome back welcome back all right hope everybody out there doing fine if so let's get straight into the video now guys today i just doing a short video we're gonna do some stew fish today with some provision and again i'm cooking a little lentil and rice to go with that guys today we are cooking Till for last me at least three days. We we'll see how it goes. If it don't, it may last me two. Yeah. So, with that being said, let me show you what we can cook up today. Cook up today. All right. So I only have a few of the items here, and this is basically just what you guys need, really. This is just it. Um, already cut up. What I'm going to use as veggies in my um fish stew. Um, I have some a bell pepper here guys and onion. I don't have any more garlic guys I forget to buy some so I have to use garlic powder So this can go for Mr. Fish In the bowl here guys I have my fish already Wash and in and soaking lime and salt and season guys. So it's been sitting there since morning um, I had it in the fridge and I'll take it out fish there and the type of fish guys it is marlin fish here we have one sweet potato this is actually the orange sweet potato and we have some green banana here friend of mine bring these sorry guys planting a friend of mine bring these for me so they may ripe yet so i just take three from the bundles so we can cook them up we have flour here cut this one again do the dumpling with guys for the dumpling all you need flour salt a little sugar knead them that's the dumpling guys that's it you could add a little coconut to it and get coconut dumpling or you could add cornmeal and get cornmeal dumpling that's it guys uh i don't have no coconut so instead i can put coconut milk in the in it when i need in it guys to give it a coconutty flavor so that can be there guys we had these three banana here cut them smash up and thing so me say we can do a little uh banana bread with it so that that is just so big a banana bread and we're going to cut up some of this cucumber to go at the side that's it and you don't know you're going to need a little seasoning and thing for when you're flavoring your pot and so forth so as we go we will show you the seasoning we put in it so that's it guys that's it so let's get cooking so we're going to peel the potato now and the plant is a day closer to me so what you need you guys we have a bowl in the the planting guys is seen like killing green banana. There's one in my There you have it, planting guys. I will do another one for you guys to see. Guys, you want to keep your hands wet because this thing is sticking in your hand, right? So that's why so you wet it first and now you pull it back. So just take your time and peel away the top of this too. And if you cut off here, so make it easier for yourself. Just take it time, guys. Take 
in the matter. And that's how you peel plantain. So you get finished peel this one, peel my potato because it's going to be a lot to peel a potato. And then we're going to come back because we're going to pack by in the guys. Alright, so we're going to peel these and get them in the pot. Alright, so plantain and potato is in. Guys, all I put in the water is a little salt, that's it. So yeah, they got bubble up there. Meantime, we need to eat the dumplings. So when these partially don't cook, I will need to say half cook. We can add the dumplings. Right, so we will need some dumplings. dumplings. So guys, I'm not adding the coconut milk anymore. I'm just going to add cornmeal and call it a day. So get the cornmeal in here. So we're going to dump. So when we don't drop the dumpling, I'm going to wash it my rice, guys. Now, guys, when we dress the food, when we dress the food, guys, the dumpling then don't be small. So we take some like this and we farm it like this. If you guys can see, flatten it a little bit, and this is how this is how it is. See that? So this is how we want the dumpling, and you just drop them in boiling water. So we need the rest. All right, guys. So everything is in there. So we just then cover back this now. Let it cook up. Guys, we need some pop body now for holidays. Oh, we got to get ourselves some food to pop set. And we need guys, so ready to fry my fish. The oil is on the heating up. In my bowl, I have flour, paprika, and um cornmeal, guys. And that is all that I need for this. That is it, guys. You don't need no salt, nothing. So if you want, you could add some seasoned salt in the flour. But because I already had the fish soaking all day in seasoning, you don't need it. So there we have the fish and the flour. Take your fish and dust it in the flour, knocking out the excess. And on to frying. So I just fry mine on high high heat so they go brown fast. Alright, 
right guys so on to strewing my fish so guys we're gonna use some of the same oil here in our pan <laughs> some food now guys over here we have the rice and peas there yeah, guys i cut up all the dumpling the sweet potato and the plantain guys so yeah look at that guys you know like right plantain but it's green plantain guys guys so here is the food guys mm -hmm. this is how i share it oh okay, guys this one is mine i don't mind the bowl looks so messy i didn't even have to take any rice so guys we're going to dig into this now see you in the next video hope you're inspired to go in the kitchen and do your thing to mama love you guys keep safe see you in the next one bye guys yeah.